Hey, Max Ola here. This is a beginner's guide to earning platinum, Warframe's premium currency. If you're skeptical or unsure, don't worry. Unlike most games, Warframe allows for simple and honestly pretty easy farms for platinum, even though it's a premium currency. The most reliable way to start accruing platinum is to collect and open relics for prime parts. If you're new to the game, clearing the star chart will benefit you greatly. Spend time passively collecting relics as you do this, so that you have a stockpile for later. There are several ways to acquire relics. You can obtain relics in void missions pretty consistently. Void capture missions like Hepit and Uko are fast ways to stock up on Lith and Meso relics. Disruption on Lua can also give you Neo or Axie relics. But you'll need to finish the second dream to unlock Lua. Endless missions rotate relics as rewards also. For example, Sanctuary Onslaught can drop a relic as a reward for completing a rotation. Elite Sanctuary Onslaught has a chance to drop Radiant Relics too. So when should you focus on getting relics the most? Whenever DE unvaults or introduces new Prime Frames and weapons, it's a good idea especially to stock up then, because you can wait until they've been vaulted again, and their value goes up. How do you check the value of items? Warframe.market is your go-to tool for this. Unlike Trade Chat, Warframe Market has fair prices, and you can also check sellers' reputations before you buy and sell. On Warframe.market, there is a buying and selling list. You can check the value of your items there. Warframes and weapons sell more as sets, so collecting all the parts of a frame or weapon, and their blueprints, will net you more profit in the end. Don't worry if your items don't seem to sell for much plat. Every two weeks, Barrow Key Tier shows up in one of the relays. He's a void trader, and you can visit the kiosks in the relays to turn prime junk into ducats. With ducats and credits, you can buy prime mods from Barrow, which sell for a decent price on Warframe Market. If all else fails, you can sell your prime junk for a little plat, but this usually isn't the best for making large sums of plat. A word to the wise, do not take free or large amounts of platinum from strangers. There have been notable cases where bans have been automatically issued for sketchy trades. Keep yourself safe by trading at market value and checking seller and buyer reputation before trading. Be sensible. Now, you know how to earn yourself platinum. Good luck and have fun. As always, thank you for watching. If I've helped you today, subscribe and ring the bell to show your support for the channel. I'll be making more beginner guides soon for those of you who have just started Warframe. If you have feedback, remember to leave a comment so I can improve my videos to better help you, the viewer. Take care. See you next time.